Hello and welcome to 5 Minute Math. Today we are looking at the third grade concept of comparing fractions. This is standard 3.3H in the great state of Texas and we'll be using an item off the 2016 released star test, item number 16. If you haven't done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, see if you can solve this on your own, and then when you're finished, unpause it, we'll look at our answers together. So Bailey and Dylan each ate pies that were the same size. Bailey ate one third of his pie, Dylan ate one fourth. Which statement is true? Now it's important for us to know that these pies do have to be the same size because we are going to compare these fractions. We're going to be comparing one third and one fourth. And if the pies were different size, we wouldn't be able to compare them fairly because if Bailey's um, pie was twice as big as Dylan's, then he might have a smaller fraction but still eat a bigger piece because his pie is that much bigger. But since they're the same size, we can go ahead and compare these. And really, we're just looking at one-third and one-fourth. So let's go ahead and just take a look at what we have here. So remember our numerator, the one in both of these fractions, that's going to be the number of pieces, right? So let me put pieces right up here. And then the denominator, that is going to be the total. In this case, it's going to be the total number of slices in the pie. So I'm going to put total slices. So Bailey had one third. That means one piece out of three total slices. I'm going to draw one third right here just so we can get a visual of it. So when we draw one third, we kind of make a little peace sign like this. And there's my one third. Now we have Dylan with one fourth. That means one piece, but there are four total slices. So the denominator is bigger. I'm going to try to draw my circle about the exact same size, but it is a drawing, so it's not to be perfect. So I'm going to draw this right here. And then the question is, which statement is true? Well, let's take a look at these statements. F, the boys ate the same amount of pie because both fractions have a numerator of one. They do both have a numerator of one. And whenever you have a numerator of one, it's called a unit fraction. It's the smallest fraction uh, in a set here. So whenever you have a numerator of one, it's called a unit fraction. But I do not believe they ate the same amount of pie. So this is correct. Both fractions have a numerator of one. But if you take a look, Dylan's pie is split up into four pieces. And Bailey's pie is split up into three pieces. To me, it looks like they're different sizes. It looks like we might be a little bit bigger right here because Bailey has got a little bit more area here. So I'm going to say this is incorrect here. I don't think they're the same amount. If they were the same amount, they would need to be the exact same fraction. They either need to be both one-thirds or both one-fourth. But since we already said that the pies were already the same size, if the numerators are different or the denominators are different, they're most likely going to be different unless they're for some reason equivalent fraction. But we know they're not because they have the same numerator. So G. Bailey ate more pie because each slice of pie cut into three equal parts is larger than each slice of pie cut into four equal parts. So this is that Bailey eats more pie because even though this number three is smaller than four, when you cut a pie into three parts, each of those parts are slightly bigger than a pie cut into four parts. That's what I think is correct. I think this Bailey's piece is going to be bigger because three equal parts is going to be larger than four equal parts. Let's look at H. Dylan ate more pie because the denominator of four is larger than the denominator of three. Well, the denominator of four is larger than the denominator of three, but that just means the same amount of pie is cut into more pieces, and each piece is going to have to be smaller, so that's going to be incorrect. And then J, there's not enough information to determine who more, ate more pie? Nope, there definitely is. Our answer is going to be G. Because when you have the same numerator, you can say this, one-third is greater than one-fourth. You can compare the denominators.